Tesla is gearing up to ship robots by the dozen, but rumors have it design is an issue and production's on hold. Boston Dynamics just released new details about Atlas. Stick around to find out what's new under the hood. And Figure, with its third-generation humanoid, promises a life free of household chores. Should we get excited, or is this just an excuse to raise yet another bajillion in capital? Today, we delve into the tech race between Tesla, Figure, and Boston Dynamics, and we'll do it together with the AI super brain, Magi. It's a platform where the world's most advanced neural networks work as one, united by a shared memory. Let's get it. Starting off with Atlas, the usually secretive Boston Dynamics team recently revealed unexpected details about the robot's brain and build. It's a real breakthrough. Getting your robot to do a backflip is an engineering party trick. Getting it to work reliably for eight hours straight now that's a real challenge. Here's the rundown. Figure 03 debuted recently and made quite a lot of noise, most of it from this game changer, palm cameras. But little did most of us know, the first ones to recreate Pale Man from Pan's Labyrinth were actually Boston Dynamics engineers. That's right, the announcements came almost simultaneously, but the Hyundai Motor Group affiliate has done did a Boston left on figure. So what's the deal with the hands? Well, good things come in threes, that's why packed with tech, the GR2 Gripper has that number of fingers, giving it 7 degrees of freedom. As it turns out, the new opposable thumb is indispensable. Who'da thunk it? Not exactly a revelation since most humanoid makers realized that long ago, but the Bostonian native has its own philosophy. Human hands are way too bulky for a robot that's meant to outperform them, not just copy. From full rotation in the neck and torso to arms as strong as industrial grippers. Three fingers instead of five is a deliberate choice. Three is enough for complex handling. More fingers means more failure points and higher costs. And then the palm cameras. Atlas can literally see what it's holding from just an inch or a few centimeters away. Tactile sensors prevent it from crushing objects by adjusting grip pressure in real time. And here's the kicker. The fingers bend backwards 90 degrees. Uncanny hypermobility. It opens up completely new grasping strategies. If this was a human, they'd definitely be in Cirque du Soleil. Atlas has mirrored left and right grippers without a dominant hand. It simply chooses whichever gives the best angle or most stability. This is pure efficiency. Even Saitama would be jealous. But what makes all this even more powerful is the brain. Boston Dynamics used to program robots line by line. Now, they're teaching Atlas by imitation. You show it what to do. Explain each movement in layman's terms, a behavioral model then learns to mimic the motion while remembering the description, linking language to action. In the end, you can just tell Atlas what to do and it figures it out how. No pun intended. On a side note, how we built that story. We took two long form articles and a video of Atlas, then we shared them with the Magi platform and let it do what it does best. Be the control center for the world's most powerful AI models. You see. While everyone is juggling 5 subscriptions and 20 browser tabs, Magi users get access to over 40 top AI models, ChatGPT, Claude, Gemini, GPT Image, and even mid-journey level image generation, all in one clean dashboard. The best part? All the models share a common memory. That lets you switch between them seamlessly depending on the task. GPT-5 for text analysis, Gemini for extracting insights from videos, and Claude for adapting content to your unique tone and style. And with Magi, they all understand what you mean. Moving on. By now, you've probably figured out that since we started with Atlas, the naturally figure is up next. And you'd be right. Check out Figure 03 from this slick demo if you haven't already seen the new robot. What's behind it, though? Once again, we turn to Magi for advice to collect and analyze the latest scoop. And here's what we found. Basically, Grok is one of the best neural networks for web search. It helped us gather the data, and GPT-5 analyzed it to highlight key upgrades as follows. Figure 03's Helix brain is a fully end-to-end -end AI model. Instead of multitasking separate algorithms, it links vision and language directly to action. This means faster learning, show and understand, less manual coding and better adaptability to real-world changes. Not exactly a new concept. Elon Musk originally proposed the same architecture for the Tesla robot, a single brain managing both perception and action. But Figaro 3 is here now, and Optimus is expected to demo in just a bit under a month. Figure's second upgrade is vision built for manipulation, a wider field of view, higher frame rate, lower latency, and again, 
palm cameras for better handling of occluded objects. Makes you wonder, did Figure and Boston Dynamics come up with the idea of palm cameras at the same time, or was it a similar story to Apple, Microsoft, and Park Xerox? What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. The robot also got a design polish, lighter frame, soft materials, fewer pinch points, inductive foot charging, and if the demo video is accurate, its feet can bend just like Optimus. Although in Tesla's case, experts still debate whether those joints are active or passive, actually, much like figures. Drawing more parallels, Tesla uses data from thousands of cameras on its cars to train Optimus. We talked about how that works in one of our previous videos found in Tooltips. Now, figure has gone even further forming a partnership with Brookfield, one of the largest real estate owners in the world. This gives Figure access to real human environments, warehouses, offices, even homes, where its robots can learn from real-world interactions. In other words, Figure didn't just get a lab, it got a training world for its robots as authentic as can be. Now, from what we gather, the humanoid race is moving towards the same goal, finding the perfect design and the most universal AI brain. Yay? or nay? Let us know in the comments. Finally, on to Tesla. For the past month, media headlines have claimed Elon Musk paused his robot production because of design and scaling issues. Recent reports, however, say Tesla placed a $685 million order with a Chinese company, Sanghua Intelligent Control, for linear actuators, key joint components for Optimus. If confirmed, this isn't just another contract, it's a sign that China's supply chain is becoming strategically important for bringing Optimus to the market. Is it true though? We ask AI. According to GPT-5, there's no official confirmation as of yet, even though the story spread across multiple Chinese media. If it is indeed accurate, it would mean that Tesla Bot's design is finalized and the robot is close to mass production. If not, then Musk is still struggling with the robot's hands, despite clear progress in leg movement and AI. AI control. You've seen the Kung Fu video, right? In our previous episode, we explained why that's actually a huge milestone for Optimus's brain. Let's recap. To build this story, we used Claude for synthesis, Gemini for video analysis, GPT-5 for structure and logic, and Grok for web search while Llama for handling long form context. All of it worked out in a single chat, with zero loss of context between each and every model thanks to this Magi's killer feature, no copy pasting, no mumbo jumbo. Here's five reasons why Magi is perfect for anyone who's into robotics and future tech. Switching between models with zero context loss is as easy as pie. No other platform is this seamless. 40 plus AI models in one dashboard? Stop piling up subscriptions for ChatGPT+, Claude Pro, Midjourney, and others. True multimodality. Text, images, video, PDFs, even YouTube transcripts by simply pasting a link. Built-in tools for editing and export. Enhance images, remove backgrounds, add details, write documents, and export straight to PDF. It's more than just a chatbot. It's a full-on AI studio. Workspaces, personas, and team collaboration. Create custom AI personas like robotics analysts, for example, share projects, and work together. Basically, whether you write about robots, build them, or just follow the race, Magi fits perfectly into your workflow. Import videos and documents, switch between models, keep your context, create charts, and export your work. This is mission control for all your AI needs. And if you're already paying for multiple AI subscriptions, do the math. One dashboard, 40 plus models, collab tools, workspaces, image editing, all for the price of a single premium plan. Magi free trial through the link below. Share your thoughts in the comments, subscribe to the channel, like our videos, and check out our socials for more from the world of high tech.